What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Blue Blood Sports TV. Back at y'all with another one. And another sad loss, tragic loss in the sport of boxing. Uh, we have lost um, Maximum Dadashev. Uh, after Friday night, he fought uh, a hard, tough fight, man. He took a lot of punishment in the fight. Um, he This fight was stopped. Buddy McGirt uh, was his trainer. Buddy McGirt stopped the fight. Um, uh, he said that he took too much of a beating. Buddy McGirt was saying... Uh, he said, I have to stop. It was an epic stoppage in the corner. Um, um, Buddy McGurk was praised for it. Um, he lost to Sabriel Mate Mateus, right? And um, he took a lot of punishment in that fight. They walked him to the stretcher where Timothy Bradley had a meltdown, saying, why was the stretcher not on the side of the ring? Why was it not more available? They walked him to the stretcher through the crowd, Um he was a young fighter, 28 years old, uh, Russian fighter. Um, they walked him to the stretcher. When he got to the stretcher, he started uh, vomiting, you know, on the side of the stretcher and at the stretcher, you know, um, very uh, violently, you know, um, which is a telltale sign. Uh, they took him to the nearest hospital trauma center, uh, which they stated that um, he lost consciousness in the ambulance on the way to the trauma center. Uh, he was in a medically induced coma to reduce some of the pressure on his brain, but ultimately he succumbed to the injuries and um, lost his life. Um, it resulted in a loss of life. So, you know, um, sad news, man, 28 years old, uh, young guy, man. Uh, and he still wanted to fight, um, ironically enough. When Buddy McGirt was trying to stop the fight, he still was trying to push the fight and um, Buddy McGirt refused. Um, he said, if I don't stop it, they're gonna stop it. You know, um, he said, I got to you got to let me do this champ. And uh, feel I feel bad for this guy's family, man. I feel bad for Buddy McGirt. You know, Buddy McGirt told another guy in the corner because there's obviously a language barrier. And uh, Buddy McGirt told the other guy in the corner, he said, listen, man, you got to be honest with me. You got to be honest in this situation. You got to let me stop this fight. Be truthful. You got to be truthful. So, again, trans um, translating that. When you translate what I'm saying, tell them the truth. Don't don't half step because you got to be 100 percent truthful in this situation because this is life or death. And ultimately, it was death over life. So um, sad, sad news, man. We're going to do a 10 second moment of silence for this um, young man that lost his life at the age of 28 years old, man. Um, again, Maximum Dadashev uh, succumbed to his injuries brain injuries he suffered and uh it resulted in him losing his life um let's give a 10 second moment of silence peace and blessings to his family man my prayers are with his family uh man sad sad news man another loss uh, this following the loss of, uh, obviously, Hall of Famer Sweet Pea Pernell Whitaker, who was tragically um, taken away from us um, just a week prior to this, days prior to this, you know. Um, again, Maximus um, Dadashov succumbed to his injuries, resulted in him passing away, ultimately passing away after his fight Friday night with uh, Gabriel um, what uh, uh what, what's his name uh Sabril Matias, so peace and blessings. My prayers go out to his family, man. Sad, sad news. Y'all know what it is, man. It's your boy Blue Blue Blood Sports TV. Hate, like, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the bell icon to get all the new notification. Follow me on Instagram at Blue Blood Sports TV. All one word. You already know what it is. Shout out to the entire LDBC. Shout out to New Media. Shout out to Black Media Row. Make sure you like and share these videos. That's all I got for y'all. Peace.